Hello, I'm Bess Massey. I'm the academic director here at Blue Ivy. And this year I had the real, real privilege of getting to also be a college coach with Mariana Nicasa. Um, and I'd love for you to hear a little bit about her process, what she decided to study, and where what's the final decision that she's made. Tell us a little bit about your college coaching experience at Blue Ivy. Yeah, of course. So um, I started coming with Blue Ivy two years ago, actually, at the end of my sophomore year in high school because I wanted to get um, like college orientation to see what I wanted, what I needed for the college process. And then I just continued with Blue Ivy coaching in many different fields, SAT prep, in essay prep, and just everything, guidance about the process, where I should apply to, where I shouldn't apply to. And yeah, they were really, really important guides. You know? Is there anything that surprised you or that stood out the most about the college process that was different than what you may have imagined when you first came? Um, I think what most stood out to me was how many steps there are to the process. It's so incredibly long. I can't, like, I don't know how I was able to finish it and finish it all. It's very complicated. Yeah. But, yeah, I think that was definitely the most challenging. Okay. And tell us a little bit about what field you've decided to go into. What are you looking to study and how did you decide upon that? Well, I am going into economics and I've always really liked math, but I've also really liked um, humanities and social sciences, so I feel like economics is kind of the perfect marriage of those two areas. And I also think that economics is just a really good way to understand the world and understand how things work and why they work in those ways. So yeah, that's why I'm hopefully going into economics. I think one of the things that I loved when we were writing your essays, when we were working together, was how much you directly see what you're going to study with real life applications. And I know you talked a lot in your essays about really wanting to implement change, really looking at issues of social justice, looking at issues of economic equality. And so I was really inspired by you, the fact that you want to study economics and then really apply it to make change in the world that we live in. Um, so you were accepted into an incredible, really, list of very, very selective, really just incredible schools, including Johns Hopkins, University of Pennsylvania, Swarthmore, Northwestern, I'm sure there's more on the list that I'm forgetting, but tell us where did you decide to go and why did you decide that? Um, well, in the end, I decided to go to Princeton University uh, because I really like the undergraduate focus that the university has. I feel like I can have a personal relationship with the professors. I can go to them if I feel like I need help, and I feel like that makes the Princeton education very different from other like undergraduate level educations. So yeah, they're lucky to have you, sweetheart. Absolutely. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. That is. Congratulations. Thank you.